Welcome back to another episode of North of the Console, where hopefully my laptop won't shut down out of nowhere in the middle of a game. We are talking about Old Boy before. We were talking about Old Boy, not that any of you would know that, because the footage has been fucking lost. We are talking about lots of lost. Now, I will say, I can handle a lot of sh crazy shit in movies, but I don't know. There are just some movies I don't think I could handle. Like, uh... Like Old Boy? Like Old Boy. Or... There's a movie by... Friggin' Lars von Trier called... Antichrist. And... I like Lars von Trier, but... Holy fuck. Like, that movie just looks... Insane. Or, um... Uh... Let's see. No, I can't think of any others. No, there, there's this... One movie... See, I wouldn't mind seeing Old Boy. I heard it's supposed yeah. to be really good. I would do it. I'd, I probably wouldn't, like... One I, movie I yeah. will never see Yeah. is Human Centipede. Oh, fuck that movie. My sister has seen it, and my dad has too, and they say it's hilarious, but... Honestly... I'm, I'm sure it's hilarious, but it's also pretty gross. Yeah, that's just not something I need in my life. I don't need that kind of imagery. Like, just... No. That's all I need to say for that movie. No. Although if we, as North of the Console, were human centipede, <laughs> we would be the front. I would hope I'd be the front. I don't need to be, uh... I really would not want to be anyone else. I, uh, I gotta say, I think it would be them, because isn't it traditionally the ones who, uh, are in the front of, uh, the human centipede, the ones who speak a different language? And, uh, not to me say any, as in anything oh. mean, Ben, but, uh, you do make up some words that we just don't understand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> shit. I fell, I fell out of the ship. Yeah, you and I can't go, go that backwards. Way. Yeah, okay. Well, you can go that way, but... It's... I remember getting killed going that way. Yeah, it's... No! God damn it. Oh, what the shit is that? That happened in another video, don't. too. Don't do this to me, Julian. Don't stop doing this. No! Come on! You will build your lust of lots of loins. Uh, you no, will build. God, 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 stop! God, God, stop God. this madness! You're annoying. You really do suck at this. Stop saying that! Am I annoying? Yes. Why? Because you're Ben. Because I'm sexy. <laughs> the ladies dig me. God. What is that shit? <laughs> I pressed the button to make me grab the. Mm. Two minutes in. We're two minutes in, and I'm Sorry, already dying. In. And yeah, you're already dead. Okay, we're we're not going to the moon. <laughs> we're going somewhere else. I remember that being a tough place. Let's go to Africa. And mine some blood diamonds. No doubt, Scrooge McDuck has some of those. <laughs> I also would not surprise me if he, you know, had uh, children working in those mines. Remember we did this the last video, Jules? We did? Yeah. I there, did. there was grown men, and we made the joke that he might be the only one in Africa using grown men as workers. I don't remember that joke. I could imagine. Maybe Huey, Dewey, and Louie. If we ever get fans, the they're going to be so pissed off at us. <laughs> Actually, we have eight subscribers now. Yes. Thank you, number... Well, to whoever you are, you are a wonderful person. If you want to come hang out with us, hey, you can do that. Shit. Oh, come on. If oh. there would be one other Let's Player that you'd be really excited to know that they're a fan, who would it be? Probably have to be someone in Achievement Hunter. Gavin, Michael, Jeff. Oh, shut up, Scrooge. You stay here, you little bastards. This is also... Well, I didn't say that just so, you know, I could put Achievement Hunter in the tag. <laughs> <laughs> well, some, some people who are just, like, endlessly scanning YouTube are going to be very disappointed when they find us. <laughs> But, um, no, I, I'm, I'm, you know. Who would you choose? Curious. You know what? I got to say, uh, one of the Game Grumps. Hmm. I was, I'd also like if Jontron. Yes. Or even the guys from Continue. 
even though we do kind of have contact with them. Yeah, we got one uh, message from Nick Murphy. I'll yeah. continue, guys. We so. love you, Nick. Yes, Nick. <sighs> if uh, you need anything, and I mean anything, <laughs> Jules will do it for you. Oh, wow. So you're volunteering me for the sexual favors? Yes. Yeah. You would be sucking his dick, Jules. Well, you know, man's got to do what a man's got to do, right? <laughs> that, that sounded great in the playback. Though, thinking about the Scottish accent, that is one tough... Matt Cox is now online. Um, wow, okay. Are you saying you want to take Matt Shut Cox? Up. Take Matt to someone in new high school. Wow, wouldn't it be funny if we started getting vo uh, mm. voices? If we started getting messages while we were filming? I don't have a lot of people on my friends list, so... Eh, I don't think either either of us do for any of our consoles. But, um, what was I saying? Yeah, Scottish accent, fucking impossible to understand. Yeah, we made this joke before. God damn, okay, this is the rehashing jokes <laughs> episode, because it's been so goddamn long that none of us remember, oh, you remember, apparently. Well, I'm the one who, uh, who edited these videos, so... Okay. Oh! Come on! How is there not a guy there? No, 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 Good job, no. Jules. Good fucking <laughs> job. MJ, I don't appreciate... The... God damn it, Vince! Stop touching me! I'm not touching you. We're essentially rubbing Jules' legs. And I don't like it. Mm. Ah, well, he says Indiana he doesn't Jones. like it, but... He has a look in his eye that says... Come closer, guys. Yeah, I have a look he doesn't come, And he has a look saying, Come hither at me. Come hither at me. That is not <laughs> grammatically correct. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck oh, you. suddenly you know grammar and such. Oh, I do. And suddenly such. <laughs> I'm I trying to uh, purposely be uh, grammar and grammatically incorrect. You. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> grammatically incorrect. Uh, at least it's not politically incorrect. Well, I mean. Oh, I don't give a shit if it's in politically incorrect or not. You know what? I'm going to make a politically incorrect statement right now. Yeah. I don't much care for ostriches. <laughs> Just putting their heads in the sand, not doing anything. Get back to work, ostriches! <laughs> I like that. That's really good. Really? You are prejudiced against ostriches. You are ostrophobic. You're ostrophobic. I ostracize ostriches. <laughs> That's the reason you made this joke, right? To say that? Actually, not not at first, but, you know, I realized it came or, it the came perfect organically. thing. Yeah. Yes. Uh, I would have been stupid not to say it. Yeah, I gotta say, you would have, because that is actually really good. You know the joke is funny when we're complimenting our own jokes <laughs> and just going on about it. We are stroking our own dicks, people. <laughs> We're literally like stroking our, like no jokes, we're actually taking our dicks out right now and stroking them off. Like taking our, clasping our hands around our dicks and we're going up and down, up and down. Ben Wonder with the can... least sensual descriptions of jacking off. You wonder if you could what? Masturbation. Um, <laughs> no, but I was wondering if I could find a picture of masturbation to safely put on YouTube. Um, we'd probably end up getting either a, our video removed, or, or no, 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 you know what you could do? And we'll take this, well, maybe we won't take this part, this conversation out of the video. Look up something having to do with farmers. You know how the way they have to do it for the horses and the bulls and all <laughs> oh, that? Yeah. Not kidding, folks. We should really be paying farmers a hell of a lot more. Because they do some nasty shit for us. Yeah. Well, it depends. If they're also masturbating the horses to breed them for uh, sport. For the uh, sport running. Yeah. I mean... You do get quite a lot because those uh, prize money, if you win those derbies... Oh yeah, they get paid a fuck ton. Yeah. So, uh, those guys already get paid enough. 
We're talking about actual farmers. Yeah, we're talking about farmers, you know, that put food on your plate. If that man is willing to masturbate a two-ton bull with horns longer than, like, fucking... I don't know. I can't think of an example, but... The, put it this way. Those animals could kill you. If he's willing to do that for you to make sure you get meat and all this kind of stuff... You really owe that guy a lot. So, Key, so you could stuff your face with meat. Yeah, you awful, awful, ungrateful people. How can you eat your pudding if you don't eat your meat? How can you eat your meat if you don't eat your pudding? <laughs> Where is that from? Pink Floyd. Pink? Really? Yeah. That sounds more like Pink a Floyd comedy thing than like something off a Pink Floyd album. It was actually off their movie. The Wall? Oh, I haven't seen... Or their album, whatever you want to call it. Not a fan of Pink Floyd, I gotta say. Pink Floyd. Um, I like them. One thing I noticed while working. Uh huh. When their songs play. Yeah. Uh, it's not the greatest band to be listening while working <laughs> because they have like a lot of random noise in their songs. <laughs> where me working at a gas station, think that like. Shit. Yeah, th those are that's nice to kill. Yeah, thank you. So working at a gas station. Yeah, um, they have a lot of random noises where it's like I hear the, I hear them. I hear the. I hear the noises. <laughs> I hear the noises. <laughs> yeah, you hear. And it. I'm like thinking there's like someone coming, like orgasming. Like no, like someone trying to get into the, like someone like knocking at the door or something or a car pulling up. And it's like I always stop, you know, my work, and I'm like. What? Oh, oh, no, never mind. It's a oh, Pink Floyd no. song. Okay, okay, uh, uh, what do I do? Duh, uh, X to jump. Okay. And duck go under those. There you go. You are actually getting better at this, Jules. No! You said you spoke too soon. You spoke too soon, jackass. Jules, you know what this does show, though? What? I have faith in you that you will actually beat a level now. People, we have a chance. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Glory oh, be. Fucking shit. Wait, I think there we should I should really start at African Mines again because yes. this seems to be. This is my level. <laughs> this is. Uh. The... <laughs> what? He just grabbed my dick. <laughs> I did it! <laughs> People, Julian is making this up. I'm Who are you going to believe, people? I'm warning you, jackass. <laughs> Either come out of the closet or stop touching me. Hey, I'm, I'm not gay. And I'm going to keep on dancing. Now, see, you, I know, I are safe. Come on, bud. You, I swear to now Christ. We just I, now we go closer. We need to get a camera, because <laughs> this is getting out of hand. And we're missing a lot of visual... <laughs> Ah, uh, god damn it! If we had a camera for that, we could have put that on Pornhub for tickling porn. Do I get a cut? I mean, I don't know how Pornhub works, Jules. <laughs> we haven't even got paid for putting our videos on YouTube yet. We still need to figure that out. Well, you know what? This is something um, I'm sure the viewers don't want to hear about. Yeah, don't worry. We won't talk about it. But you know one thing I will say. Mm -hmm. Even if we just make a couple of dollars off this, I will be happy because I could say I made money off the video game industry. Mm. Yeah, I like that idea too. Out of my way, you fucking slugs. And at the same time, uh, it will be really cool to uh, go in for like tax seasons and be like, uh, yeah, so I have to uh, call this video game I bought for <laughs> tax reasons. Oh my god. Imagine if we could get to that point where it's like, our, like we ha we work we do this for a job and our video games become like tax deductible and shit like that. That'd be awesome. Yeah. That, Oops. That, oh like yeah. Most people are being like, you know, I'm sure the people of Game Grumps okay. and Achievement Hunter and mm -hmm. um, Smosh Games. I'm just adding tags at this point. Um, <laughs> uh, they're all like, you know, 
My dream is to play video games for a living. My dream is to make video games tax deductible. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so people, please just help us get fans. You know you want us to succeed. You know you want it. You know you want it. You know you want it. Sing this you know song. Oh, tickle me. Fuck off! Because oh. you're a good gamer! Uh. Can it get past me? Uh -huh. You did it! Oh, <laughs> shit. That was really good. <laughs> that that was really close there. That, that's not really good, but you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up, Dewey. <laughs> or Louie. Or Huey. Or whichever one you are. Yeah, I'm not too sure exactly which one they are. Interchangeable duck family. They never really explain who their mother or father is. They have a lot of uncles. I was thinking about something on the way over here because, you know, I was just listening to my iPod and I was getting lost in whatever I was listening to. Oh, shut up, friggin' lady. Um, was you it, know? Uh, no, it has... What? Was it Christmas Gallagher? Yes, I was listening to Noel Gallagher. Which, by the way, I'll talk about that in a minute. Um, holy shit. Yeah, Can't go on, there. please. Um, what was I? What was I going to say? Yeah, I was thinking about something in video games. In The Legend of Zelda, specifically Ocarina of Time. You know how the Gerudo are an entirely female clan of, you know, thieves and all that. Oh yeah. Um, Ganondorf is the male of that group, and if I remember the lore right, a, a male is born to the Gerudo once every one hundred years. So that either means, well, first of all, that could mean they're all technically lesbians together, because there's only one man born every, you know, every, there, every hundred years. Uh, oh shit! Oh no, I'm getting, I'm getting to that part in a minute. Um, so unless the Gerudo women go to like Hyrule Castle Town, or you know, just it would be all. You know, lesbians until Ganondorf shows up. And since they all look like Ganondorf, they could all be his children. Yeah. Or there could be, like, uh, the new Wonder Woman. Uh, or I shouldn't say the new Wonder Woman. People think the movie. Hmm. When they redid it for the new 52, mm -hmm. they uh, changed the story somewhat a bit. So that, um... How do I get that one? Uh, probably that rock there. Hey, go on. Uh, they changed the story so that the Amazons... <gasps> don't, yeah. uh... Oh. Because it's all women. Yeah. What they do is that when there's, like, nearby ships that come by, mm -hmm. they'll go on, fuck all the guys on there, <laughs> and then kill them. Wow. And, uh, any male that's born, they give to, uh, who's the god of, uh... Hypostas? Yes. Uh, the one who, uh, the blacksmith, I think, what was it called? Oh, I don't know. Ephys Ephysus? Yeah, Ephysus. They give it to him, and he, they're basically his workers. Hmm. You like Greek, uh, mythology, then? Yeah, I mean, it's not as much as I used to, but... Hmm. I, uh, I never would have seen that coming from you. I don't know why. You know why, Jules? Why? It's because you couldn't think a white man could be into Greek mythology. You got what me there. Noel, Noel Gallagher? Or Christmas Gallagher, sorry. Okay. This is actually kind of a funny story. Um, uh, back in January, um, well... Me and uh, the girlfriend have been talking about, you know, going to Montreal for a weekend during July, or, or during summer in general, just, you know, a little vacation. Um, and Does this then... Does through some with Christmas Gallagher? I wish, but no. <laughs> um, so, um, I was I was like, yeah, it's, it's a cool idea, but, you know, I didn't really have a big motivation to do it. And then, Noel Gallagher was announced to be one of the guests at the Montreal uh, Jazz Festival, which, by the way, has absolutely no jazz in it. <laughs> um, so then, I still had money left over from Christmas, and I had a fuck ton out of it. So, she convinced me, yeah, buy a ticket, you and me will go there, 
you'll get to see Noel Gallagher live for the first time. It'll be a good time, all right? So I do it. I get pretty decent seats, row N, funny. Noel is uh, announced to be a guest at the Ottawa Blues Fest. <laughs> So that made me needing to go to Montreal completely redundant. I hear. But then today, my grandfather actually bought me tickets. Oh, a full pass. Oh, coming. So uh, hold up, let me finish this story. And um, my grandfather bought me a full pass, so I'll be seeing Noel Gallagher twice in the span of one week. Yes. With Greg and my brother's going to be coming down too. And this is actually a really great place to stop. Oh, yeah. see, kids. And I will say. Um, this is g stopping in the middle of a level because Jules has a chance of beating this one. This is a cliffhanger, folks. <laughs> uh, so what was I saying? Yes, kids, you can have your cake and eat it too because I'm not only do I get a trip to, to Montreal, I get to see my favorite songwriter live twice. It's on uh, his shift is at the Blues Fest is on Friday, then we bust out to Montreal, and then it's the Saturday. In July. I'm gonna have to try and find a picture of two people fucking and putting your picture in Noel Gallagher. My dream is to make video games tax deductible. <laughs>